Hi. I'm actually going to talk about potty training. Now, our son, he will be 18 months in a week. And I know a lot of people are going to think that that's way too young to start potty training. Um, but we're not like full on training. We're just kind of in the starting stages. We picked him out a toilet and basically we're kind of following what we found in this book. Checked it out at the library. It's Potty Training Your Baby um, by Katie Warren. And she's not a doctor, but she just offers a lot of common sense advice in here and I think it's a really good read. It's not a very long book at all, but it's very useful and it helps you like pick out potties and such because obviously you don't want to pick out a potty and you know your child falls off the potty and then they just see the potty as a negative thing. So it's a really beneficial book. You should check it out. Quick read. But so we got our son the baby Bjorn potty, um, the one that has the bath. So we got him that potty and basically we just started off letting him sit on the potty with all of his clothes on and we would just praise him for doing that. And then um, recently what we've been doing is we'll just ask him if he needs to go potty and we'll take his diaper off and we'll let him sit on the potty. And in the beginning, you know, not a lot happened. He would just get up and he would pee on the floor, which I expect that from him, you know. He's only, he's not even one and a half yet, so. But more recently, he's actually peed on the potty every time he sat on the potty. So, um, we went ahead and we're just kind of doing it day by day. We're not being really strict about it. We'll just ask him if he needs to go potty and we'll take his diaper off and let him sit down if he goes. And of course, you know, we praise him. And if he doesn't, it's not a big deal, you know. And when we change him, if he's wet, we explain to him that, you know, we're changing your diaper because you have pee pee or because, you know, you have poop and we're just explaining to him but we're not really saying it in a negative way at all we're just letting him know why we're changing him and um, you know we're, we get him involved in helping you know get himself a new diaper and also um, the other things that we got is baby legs because eventually if we go to the no diaper method then we'll just have them you know, wear a shirt and different baby legs. Um, these are really easy to make. I just don't own a sewing machine. Um, but I know there are a lot of people that have videos on how to make them. So if you have a sewing machine, you should really try and make them. Um, and then also what we got them are little beetle learners. These come in a couple of different colors. We got them red orange, green, and blue. I don't know where the blue is, but here's the red and the orange and the green. And these are 100% organic fair trade cotton. And these got really good reviews. They have snaps on the side, you know, so if it's a big mess, we can just snap it off and take it off. And these are reusable since we do cloth diapering. We're going to try cloth training pants as well. And I think they say like the average training time is like about six months for a child. So I just, we couldn't see ourselves paying six months for the cost of pull-ups. Pull-ups are crazy expensive. So, you know, we just got him... Um, some of these learners and uh, we're still going to use cloth diapers obviously um, for nighttime until we're more serious about the training but right now it's just we're kind of letting him decide when he's ready to try things and we're not forcing him if he doesn't want to sit on the potty then it's not a big deal we don't make him sit on the potty but we just encourage him to sit on the potty and when he does we clap and it's even better when he pees in the potty. So he's been doing really good with it though. But I just think that there's an advantage to starting off earlier. Um, obviously, 
when they get to two, then you have to start worrying about the terrible twos. And I just don't know how well he will do with training when it comes time to trying to negotiate with the two-year-old as to whether or not they're going to wear a diaper and whether or not they're going to go potty. We also ordered um, a travel potty. Um, I can't think of what it's called. It's like cool gear potty or something. And it's just a fold-up potty. I think it folds up to the size of like a small briefcase and you just put in a new baggie each time. And so if you're on the go and long car trips and your child needs to go to the bathroom, then you have this little portable potty and you don't have to worry about dirty public bathrooms or if you can't find a bathroom, at least you'll always have that option and you don't have to take the ginormous potty with you everywhere. So, Just things to think about for potty training earlier on or if you want to use cloth training pants, check out the Little Beetle Learners. Um, they got good reviews too, so we'll see how they work. I'll let you know. Okay, bye.